This video is part of a collaboration group. The other collaborators have created their own versions of this video. Please do check out their channels, links below, logos displayed at the top. Hello and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to be interviewing Mr Doolittle as to why he chose his specific van. So come with me. Hello, Mr. Doolittle. Hello, Holly Willabooby. <laughs> Stop it. Listen, I have a few questions to put to you today about this lovely van. Are you ready? Sure, Holly. Fire at will. Although, I don't actually mean fire at will. <laughs> oh, Mr. Doolittle, you're so funny. So, what model is this van? So, the van itself is a VW T6. It's based upon the short wheelbase. It's been converted by a conversion company specialist and they've turned it into their Vivanti model. So there are a lot of T6 camper vans out there. What makes Barney different? Well, first and foremost, we have a loft. A loft? Absolutely. No, 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 you haven't got a loft. We do have a loft. Okay, explain. I can do better than explain. I can show you. So, Holly, if you look up there, you'll find our loft. That's where wow. we keep all of our things. Well, got... that's a mighty big space up there, Mr. Doolittle. Absolutely. We've got our table up there. We've got our chair up there. We've got our picnic basket. We normally have our battery, our bedding. We have all sorts up there. Cooking gear, the lot. Room for dog stuff? No, no more dog stuff. So one of the other things about this van that attracted me to it is the layout. So with near enough 99% of VW conversions, you have a rock and roll bed at the back and you have a kitchen along the side. Whereas here, we've got a front lounge, which incorporates the front seats. So it makes more use of the space of the van. And finally, it's also got a built-in toilet. A toilet? It has. Well, that is impressive. I guess you could use that when you're stuck in traffic. I guess you could, Holly. Typical. Book today's holiday and we get stuck in traffic for hours. Yeah, but I'm glad we got a toilet on board though. You can't use a toilet while we're on the motorway. Wanna bet? Here, go and close the curtains for me. Oh, David. That's better. So what made you choose this specific van? So essentially, I chose this van because of the colour. You chose a van because of the colour? Yes, absolutely. It's a bit of a long story, but I will explain. So basically, I rang Leisure Drive and I was asking them for quotes on certain different vehicles. Now they get the vehicle in and then they convert it. So they asked me what colour I would like out of the VW palette. And I told them that I would like this one, which I believe is called Midnight Blue. They then rang me back and they said, it just so happens that our showroom model is an already converted version of the Midnight Blue. And they said that they could have this, we could have the showroom model for a discounted price and we would get lots of additional extras. So essentially the reason why we're now sitting in this specific van is because I wanted Midnight Blue. If oh, I, it sounds like it was made to be, David. Absolutely. If I'd have chose silver or something like that, then they would have chose a different van and we would have spec'd it up differently. So, yeah, absolutely made to be. Tell me, if someone wanted to buy a van like this, where could they go to buy it? Bolton. Bolton. Anywhere specific in Bolton? Oh, OK, you mean the, the exact dealer. So the dealer is Leisure Drive in Bolton. They converted this vehicle and they do lots of other models and um, they do a model called the Crusader and I think they also um, do a model based upon the Renault. I notice it doesn't have a fixed bed. Is this a problem when staying away? No, it's not a problem at all because the beauty of this vehicle is that it comes with a dedicated bed maker upper. So Mrs. Doolittle doesn't have to worry her head at all about the bed because Mr. Doolittle 
always sets the bed up for her. I see. So no plans to get a van with a fixed bed then? No, there are no plans to get a plan with a fixed bed. We shall be keeping this one. Well, thank you for that, Mr. Doolittle. Do you have anything to add for our viewers? Yes, absolutely I do. I hope you've enjoyed this collaboration. Guess what? It's me and Claire. She's not Holly. I'm not Holly. It's Claire. I can't pull off Holly. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, if you've enjoyed that video, please do give us a thumbs up. Give us a like and a comment. Check out the other channels that are in the collab. And yeah, join us in our next video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.